Hey guys, Dirty Pooster here. Um, what I wanted to go through with you guys real quick was how to add a different account to your Pokemon Go uh, through Nox. Um, that way, if you don't want to use an account you have, if you're worried about it getting banned or whatever, um, you can do that. A lot of people came in the stream today and were wondering how to do that. Also, I'm going to briefly talk about how to move with your keyboard. Uh, I know that was one of the more frequently asked questions uh, today. So what you're going to do to add the account is you're going to go to your settings and you're just going to simply click add an account. Um, you can either create a new account here or use an existing account that you want to use on your Pokemon Go. So enter the email and the password. Not too complicated. After this, you're going to go to Pokemon Go log into it normally. Um, as you see right here, I got my stream down. I'm actually hosting Grenader Jake, um, one of the guys that I met playing Destiny. Um, but as you see, there's people in here linking coordinates, um, talking to each other, carrying on, cussing at each other, which is great for the YouTube video. Um, but regardless, they don't know I'm doing this. Um, but if you have questions, comments, concerns, they can help you out. There's usually a mod in there, um, and they'll they'll help you get through it. I got a pretty good community. Uh, obviously, there's some haters because this is not a well liked method. Uh, the spoofing and everything else, understandably. Um, anyway, so what you're gonna do here is you're gonna come and you're gonna go to your settings, and then you're just gonna log out. So you're going to come down here and you're going to sign out. When you sign back in uh, the next time, it's going to give you the option to pick a different Gmail when you go to the Gmail option. That's all you're going to do. You're just going to sign in to whatever Gmail you want to use um, since that Gmail is now saved in Knox. Uh, the next thing I wanted to cover was how to turn um, with your keyboard. Uh, it comes standard set up to where you can use W to move north, a to move west, D to move east, and S to move south. Um, and that's all done right through your keyboard. A lot of times um, people will see this and it means your keyboard's been disabled. I did it a couple times early on and didn't, wasn't really sure what I did. Um, what I did was I hit Q and the button 1 uh, together on accident and it disabled my keyboard. So if you have issues um, with that that probably means you just accidentally disabled your keyboard. And so re-enable it and click back on your screen and you should be good to walk around. Um, walking around also hatches you eggs. Uh, this movement speed that comes standard on Knox uh, will hatch your eggs. There's ways to um, change your movement speed quicker, but I'm not familiar with that. I've never found it necessary to change it. And I want to use a speed that I know is going to hatch my eggs. Uh, if you like moving it faster, then feel free to do it that way. Um, up here are all your options. Uh, click to um, get your control and all that stuff. You can change these key binds if you want to. I leave them standard. Um, when you install Knox Fresh, this is going to come up on your screen. A uh, simple way to get rid of that is to um, come here. You're going to hit save. Um, and you're going to drop the, opac the opacity should be somewhere in the middle probably to start or something. Maybe Maybe it's 100%. I don't know. But you're going to put it on zero and you're just going to hit yes. So you're going to click here, you're going to click save, it's going to bring this up and you're going to hit yes. Uh, the tip right here, press Q and 1 to enable or disable the keyboard control. So if you can't move with your keyboard, more than likely that's what happened. Um, as far as everything else goes, if you run into issues with Knox, hard reset it a couple times, shut down the program, turn it back on. If you run into issues other than that, feel free to ask me in stream. I'll try to get to a lot. There's been a lot of people in my stream lately. Uh, I'll try to get to everybody. So thanks for stopping in. Uh, enjoy the rest of your day, and lucky Pokemon catching to you.